Hey everyone, my name's Steve, the host of Your Technology Coach, where our goal is to make technology simple for everyone. So if you recently purchased a new Windows 11 PC or laptop, I'm gonna show you five essential settings to optimize your experience. So Windows 11 provides a really good aesthetic out of the box experience. However, it handles much better after tweaking just a handful of settings to make it feel more like the Windows that you're used to. Let's try them out. Setting one is dark mode. Windows 11 offers a dark mode option that not only reduces eye strain, but gives your computer a little more sophisticated look. To enable dark mode, simply go to settings, click on personalization, then select colors. From there, you can toggle the dark mode switch on and off. Setting number two is managing notifications, which is crucial for an uninterrupted workflow. To customize your notifications, go to settings, then click on system, and then notifications. From here, you can control how and when your notifications appear. You can turn off notifications universally if you desire. However, I prefer to work through the list manually, leaving notifications on for critical tools and my antivirus software, because if my scanner needs to alert me about something, I want to hear it. Either way, this menu can cure a lot of headaches. Focus Assist takes this a step further and allows you to customize a block of time when only notifications you select are active. I can also schedule the duration of my focus time. Once customized, the button will appear available in the lower system tray in the right-hand corner of the screen. Setting three is turning on and off managing Microsoft ads. Let's go to the settings, then system menus, then notifications, and scroll down beyond the bottom of the list of app notifications. Click the additional settings, and there you'll see three additional boxes that relate to Windows 11, providing tips and suggestions on how to use your computer. If you know your way around well enough, deselect the offer suggestions on how to set up my device and get tips and suggestions when I use Windows boxes. I prefer to have the show me the Windows experience option checked so that I'm alerted when new features are announced. We're almost done. If you don't like seeing Microsoft promotions, go back to the settings menu, privacy and security and click general. Disabling show me suggestion content in the settings app does the trick, though you may want to turn off all these options. Finally, head to the settings and personalization. Device usage. The options here tell Microsoft how to use your computer so Windows 11 can provide a tailored recommendation for apps, websites, Office 365 trials, and more. Turn them all off if you're not interested in Windows 11 upselling you on more Microsoft products. By the way, if you're finding value in this video, please hit the like and subscribe buttons and share this content with someone who could benefit from these tips. Your support helps us to grow this channel so we can reach more people with helpful technology videos like these. Setting four, changing your default browser. Microsoft Edge is a really good browser, but if you're a diehard Chrome or Firefox user, switching your default browser is easy. After downloading and installing the browser of your choice, go to Settings, Apps, and Default Apps. Find the name of your browser in the list and click it. Click on the Set Default button next to the Make Browser Name Your Default Browser. You will see a few default file types changed to the new browser setting. That's it. Setting five, power and sleep settings. Windows 11 allows you to customize your power and sleep settings to best suit your needs. Go to settings, click on system and power. From there, you can adjust the time it takes for your computer to go to sleep and even customize power saving options. I can separately change the sleep time for my screen and device.
And who doesn't want to save money and electricity these days? And there you have it. Five essential Windows 11 settings that will significantly improve your experience. There's more where that came from. So don't forget to subscribe to the channel and click the notification bell so you're alerted when we post new helpful videos like this one. Thanks for watching and we'll see you on the next video.